All right, let's bring Dave in now with a look at our weather forecast. Do you remember what it was like to have 80 degree days? Oh, that's been a while. They're coming back. They're coming back. Nice. We'll time it out for you here in a second. Let's go to a live shot here from CBS 13 looking at the Sacramento River and bring up the numbers and read them and weep because it is toasty across Northern California. 93 currently in Sacramento as well as Stockton. 94 Modesto, upper 90s, 98 for Marysville. The humidity is at 28% and if you think it's feeling a little sticky out there, kind of is because dew points are in the mid 50s. Windsor Southwest at 8, barometric pressure is falling at 29.70. Speaking of extra moisture out there, take a look at what's happening off to the east from the crest line off to the east here in the Sierra. Showers and thunderstorms. We're going to do this for several more hours. Then after sunset, these will all kind of back down. And then this is going to shuffle off to the east as the high pressure goes off to the east and kind of drags the, the moisture off to the east. We're still not going to cool yet, though, even though that high pressure is moving. We're going to have to wait a while for this to get in here. Now, this will try to cool us some as we get into the early part of the weekend, but we're still looking at temperatures between about 93 and 97 degrees are just going to be dropping ever so slightly. We have to wait till early next week to get into the 80s, but we are going to get into the 80s and we're going to see a lot of them and some of those temperatures are going to be below where you'd expect to be for this time of the year. Normally we'd be about the mid 80s. Well, we're probably going to see low 80s for a couple of days and that's some good news. So hang in there. We've got that stuff on the way but it's not happening for Friday. This is what's happening for Friday. Temperatures are going to be running, as you can see, in the mid to upper 90s for the northern San Joaquin Valley, a little gusty out of the northwest, about 20 miles per hour. Into Sacramento, we'll top out at 95, mid 90s for Vacaville, a little warmer up toward Marysville and Yuba City with daytime highs just south of the triple digits. As far as the foothills go, we'll have e downsloping winds tonight, so out of the east. Temperatures tomorrow are going to be in the upper 80s on into the low 90s, so 94 for Auburn, about an 89 for Pollock Pines, upper 80s up there toward Forest Hill. Hopefully we'll get some cooling going on up here in Plumas County. Down to the low 90s for Quincy, upper 80s, Chester, and on toward Portola. And the thunderstorm activity will be done, so daytime highs will still be in the mid 80s, but we'll have plenty of sunshine in the Sierra for Friday. And we'll have stratus at the coast, and eventually it goes partly cloudy. Upper 60s for Monterey, almost 80 for San Jose. And we'll take a peek here on toward, say, San Francisco. Strong sea breeze, west 20 to 30, mid 60s there. Blustery low 90s into the delta, and it looks like we'll be into the lower 60s. And eventually fair skies up toward Fort brag. All right, not that we're bragging here, but take a look at this mid 80s and low 80s for Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. Haven't had that for a while, so three more days where it feels more like the middle of July and then we're back to something that feels more like the early part of June, especially there on Tuesday. So here's a look at some other seven day forecast for you. A bit blustery at times over toward the coast. And then we're talking temperatures getting into the upper 60s and low 70s as we get into the early part of next week in the Sierra. So that's a return to something a bit more seasonal and finally getting back into the 70s on into the foothills.